Hi, welcome to my platform. Of the four points, the one we're gonna talk about now is education. Education, like healthcare, is a contentious issue in this province. And as a product of this education system, I'm fortunate. I navigated high school with little issue. Class sizes were about 30 some students. Now I'm hearing from teachers and parents that class sizes are getting upwards of 35 to 36 students, K through nine. And I think that's unacceptable. I think to ensure that we have a good quality of education, K through nine should be capped between 25 and 28 students, not just for the quality of the education of the children, but also so our teachers don't burn out because that's a lot of children to oversee. And that's the one thing that never gets discussed, teacher burnout. These are people too, and they're trying their best. So I believe that if we find the funding to help lower those numbers, then we're gonna see a better outcome for our kids and more longevity for our teachers. With high school, I think if we can keep it capped at around 30 students, similar to when I went through the program, as they move on to university, they're gonna to have to get used to 200 student lecture halls. So 30 is a good number. But again, where we can support there is more money for education assistance for children with learning disabilities so that they don't get left behind and they get the same quality of care and education as every other child so we don't leave anyone behind. And it's as simple as that.